Welcome back to NJ.com. We're here to hand out our helmet stickers from week eight. Let's throw it over to Bill. Okay, let's start off with the Cape Atlantic League. St. Augustine might have wrapped up the number one seed in non-public group four this week. Our helmet sticker goes to Ezekiel Ennis. Six catches, 175 yards, two touchdowns, also ran for 33 yards. And the uh, shutdown corner was part of a defense that uh, led the Hermits to a 48 nothing win over Bogdan. Jeremy Schneider, let's take it back to the NJAC. Solomon Halsworth for Wes Morris. Two receiving touchdowns, two rushing touchdowns, two rushing point afters for two point conversions, and uh, that's a, he gets the game winning two point conversion and a double overtime win over Morris Knowles. Big week for Halsworth. Down to GMC, Marlon Hart did a little bit of everything on Saturday. He got three passes for 149 yards, two touchdowns. He ran a kickback, uh, 80 yards for a touchdown to end the first half. Also recovered the fumble in the fourth quarter that helped uh, Spotswood win a big game over Middlesex. Joe's of Dallas for the short conference. This week's helmet sticker winner is Ocean Township quarterback Kenny Pickett. Pickett leads Ocean to a huge 42-35 victory over Red Bank Catholic. Pickett, 12 for 21, 259 yards and three TDs through the air. He ran 11 times for 25 yards with a TD. Short conference helmet sticker winner, Kenny Pickett, Ocean Township. There's a receiver out in Jersey City. You gotta get, you gotta look at him. You gotta watch him. He's a big time player. That's Iowa commit Frank Darby. Had five catches for 133 yards to lead the Lincoln Lions past Hudson Catholic in the backyard brawl in Jersey City. <laughs> uh, Colonial Conference. We're going with Carlton Aiken. Accounted for six touchdowns last week on only eight plays. Quarterback four for ten, 131 yards, three touchdowns. Also ran four times for 143 yards and three scores. Pulse Pro. Big win over Sterling this week. In the Super Essex Conference, Michael Asuji had 267 rushing yards and two touchdowns on the ground as West Orange defeats rival East Orange 31 27. Yes. Over in the Mid State 38, we have uh, Justin Beckett from Union help them earn a big win over Ridge, uh, a different Group 5 team. Definitely not a team you'll want to play in the uh, state tournament. Union, he ran for two, 12 carries, 67 yards, all three touchdowns, that 21 13 win. Joseph Dallas again, and we're going to award the helmet sticker in the NJIC. And you might want to take a seat for these numbers, folks. Darius Stone of St. Mary's, 17 catches, 577 yards, and seven touchdowns. The NJIC helmet sticker winner, Darius Stone, St. Mary's. It's, uh, it's over to the Big North Conference, probably the biggest win of the weekend. It's DePaul knocking off then number three Paramus Catholic knocked the Paladins out of the playoffs. And a guy that, you know, came through big time for the Spartans was Quayshon Alexander. He's never played offensive tackle in his life, but he got a, a big time performance blocking Rayshon Yerry and Corey Bolds and just really filled in so big, uh, you know, for, for DePaul there. And he's also a stud defensive end going to Nebraska. He also had two big sacks in that game. So good for you, Quayshon Alexander. Now we're finishing up with the West Jersey Football League. Anthony Sees from Kingsway. 19 carries, 180 yards, two scores, also returned a fumble, uh, 80 yards for a touchdown. Kingsway knocked off Paul to six, punched her ticket for the South Jersey Group 5 tournament. That'll do it for week eight, week nine, and then the playoffs is what we have left.